Hello lovely people and um, I am back uh, with another video for you. This time it's a bit of a slightly different um, content from before. Um, obviously I've been doing a lot of plant based, plant based, plant related content uh, and I am, that leads me on to a nice segue into plant based shoes. <laughs> Um, so I have ordered some um, new shoes from uh, Will's Vegan Shoes, I think that's what they're called, yeah, uh, Will's Vegan Shoes. Um, so I have been, I spent a lot of time in my lifetime um, spending stupid amounts of money on crap shoes basically that will break and will um, like the soles come off or the trim uh, detaches itself and I end up having to spend time either gluing them together or I don't know all sorts of things um, or just buying new shoes and I'm kind of sick of it I would rather just invest um, a reasonable amount of money in some shoes that will last so um, the other problem for me has always been uh, leather shoes, I don't really want to own leather shoes, um, I don't really want to le own leather anything, having been a vegetarian for many years, it just hasn't sat right with me, um, it's not to say I particularly care what other people want to do, it's just for me personally, I don't want to have leather products, um, I think I have a couple that I bought pre this kind of thinking, um, and um, I, I haven't thrown them away because I feel like that's a waste. Um, of those products, so I'm using them till the end of their life and then I'm going to throw them away. Um, but yeah, how have I got onto this? Yes, um, so I wanted to buy a decent pair of shoes. I'm starting a new job, I want to look a bit more smart than I usually dress, and I wanted to get a decent pair of shoes. Um, and I was prepared to pay a reasonable cost uh, as sort of an investment rather than uh, a short term solution, which is what I've been doing all this time. Um, so then I took to Google to um, find out what kind of vegan shoe solutions are available to me because um, I know that now that's quite a thing. It wasn't perhaps when I first began boycotting leather. Um, I know the, the vegetarian shoe company I think does um, vegan shoes. I've heard of the vegan Doc Martens um, but I wanted to actually have something that I could wear professionally and you know not necessarily make a statement about myself in a certain way although the hair and the facial piercings and all sorts probably do that for me anyway but um, I don't know I just didn't feel like Doc Martens this time um, so I came across uh, Will's Vegan Shoes um, which is a British company I believe um, and they actually, what I really like about them is that they aren't just just about the vegan shoes. It's kind of all encompassing across the the, the business and the brand. Um, so their leather is uh, plant-based leather made in Portugal, um, and I believe they've made steps to carbon offset uh, any of the travel time um, that has been expended to produce these shoes and to get them to where they are um, and they are certified carbon neutral um, in the shipment um, as well as uh, being in recyclable packaging it just feels like they've kind of covered all the bases to me um, and they also um, employ a I believe it's a family run business or it's a small business in Portugal to make these shoes um, under certified EU human rights standards I think that's what it is it's all on the website but um, so it feels like it's an all-encompassing holistic vegan approach to this company which um, to me is really important and I feel very excited to have bought these shoes um, because they feel good not even really for the shoes it's it feels good to support that kind of business so um, I'm going to unbox these today and um, I'll try them on and show you what they look like um, and then I'm going to wear them for a, like maybe a week or so and then come back and tell you how they feel and how they wear. Um, I am prepared that they are going to be painful until I've broken them in as with any shoe. I'm going to wear them around the house for a bit um, and then 
I don't know, prepare myself for blisters. We'll see what happens. So uh, yeah, I will get into it. So the um, shoe box itself is sent in uh, recycled um, paper, brown paper, and it has carbon neutral certified on here. Um, and it says, please upcycle or recycle after use, which is awesome. Uh, they have paper tape, it looks like, which is recyclable. So yeah, it's exciting. Um, so I got, I'm going to not speak during this part. Okay, so this is my, ah, I'm really excited, <laughs> my um, Will Vegan store um, vegan shoes. And it comes in a really nice box actually, it feels stylish it feels recycled as well uh, I don't know if it is but and it says make a positive choice which is kind of their company slogan um, and with the vegan symbol on them so it means that they have been certified vegan which is excellent um, I got the Oxford brogues in tan which is not a type of shoe I have ever worn in my whole life and I'm very excited about it so and there's a little business card I don't know if that is that coming out opposite I don't know see um, and packaged in brown paper which we like okay, these look really really good <gasps> what a lovely shoe I was ever so slightly worried that these wouldn't be very feminine but it looks like they are which is brilliant So it has some really nice detailing along the bottom um, and they just feel, they feel like leather. They don't smell like leather, they kind of smell like plastic actually, but, um, and obviously they're plant-based and made with, I think, plant-based oils. Um, I'm not sure entirely what they're made from, but look at this amazing detailing. I mean, I think if I saw this in a shop, I wouldn't necessarily be able to tell that this isn't, well, I wouldn't be able to tell that this isn't leather. So good. Okay, I love these. And even the, um, the string, strings, shoelaces are um, eco-friendly, I believe, as well. So, um, these are fantastic. Oh, I'm so excited. <laughs> So, that is both of my lovely shoes. Oh, I'm so excited by these. They look fantastic. There is a slight kind of um, dent in this one, so I'm not sure what that is, but I'm going to see if I can... Yeah, I think I can probably like glue it down or something. It's not going to actually harm the integrity of the shoe, so I'm not too worried. Um, yeah, this is really exciting. Okay, I'm gonna try them on and see how they fit. Um, I have heard people say that um, these, you want to kind of size up. Unfortunately, I am size eight and that is the maximum size they go up to in ladies' shoes. So this may well be a disaster, but we'll see what happens. Um, these actually cost me 80 pounds, I believe it was. 82 pounds, um, but if you sign up to their mailing list, you get free um, delivery. They're guaranteed for 365 days and you can return them for free at any point in that time. Oh, the inside feels like suede. It's lovely. Oh, I'm very, very excited. Um, but I'm, I'm not sure how I'm going to get my feet into these, so uh, bear with me. They feel good. They feel a lovely size. Ah, I'm so excited. <laughs> I've never felt so posh in my whole life. Okay, how do I do that? Don't mind me being very unladylike here. Just need to find a way to do these up appropriately. 
these fit well on my smaller foot so uh, <laughs> let's hope that the bigger foot will also be okay <laughs> nice shoe. God, I'm such a not lady. <laughs> uh, right. I can definitely feel where they're going to rub while I'm breaking them in, so I think I might prepare myself and get um, some foot plasters and just wear them before I even get the blisters. So. Need a need a um shoe form. Okay, I love them, and they actually feel really comfy uh, for my feet to sit in. I'm not sure how they're going to feel walking in them, um, but let's see. Um, I will do a quick kind of pan down and see, um, show you how they look on my feet and. Then I will be back in a week um, and or week or so and let you know how this is all gone. Thanks guys. So I just wanted to do a quick update um, on my shoes from Will's Vegan Store because I've been wearing them now for I think this is my third week. Um, so I think I can safely say I've mostly broken these in. Um, if I do do a long walk then they start to rub again but um, for the most part they seem to be pretty good so um, sorry I'm out of breath and I don't even know why. Like I just walked across my flat and that's all I've done. <sighs> Um, so, uh, yeah, they feel pretty good. They haven't really distorted at all. Um, the one thing is, is they seem to like scuff ever so slightly. Like, I don't know if you can see here on the sides um, that they do seem to scuff a little bit, but I am notorious for um, pigeon towing. Is it pigeon towing when it's inwards? I don't know which one it is when it's inwards, um, but I do scuff my like all of my shoes have scuff marks from where my toes scuff each other so I wouldn't necessarily say that that's a flaw because I am probably more of a scuffer than most people if that makes any sense. Um, the um, soles have done pretty well like I've worn them a lot actually um, and they seem to be not really much worse off. Um, the stitching is all still in place um, everything seems happy and good and like there's a little bit of creasing um, along here but like consistent with a normal pair of shoes so I'm pretty chuffed um, I really like them they're really comfortable to wear um, I keep forgetting that I don't have my insoles in because um, I normally well insoles orthotics um, I normally wear orthotics um, with my shoes because uh, I've got collapse arches or like low arches or whatever they are um, and I don't really notice with these which is weird so um, yeah um, size wise um, they are pretty much my perfect size um, I'm generally always a size 8 I'm always wide fit in whatever I'm, I'm wearing so um, yeah and these are really comfy and they seem to have like molded quite well to my feet so um, I would say I am really very happy with these the only thing is um, they had like a little vegan mark on the inside here which was um, embossed in gold and that's disappeared I'm assuming with foot sweat um, so that's gone but other than that very happy with these shoes um, and I think they will last a good long time I'm fairly sure that the um, the heel is made out of wood I'm not totally sure but I think so and it sounds like wood but um, and I reckon once you I'd have to look into how to get these done in a vegan way um, but um, I reckon once the soles start to wear out that you can get them rehealed or resold. I'm not really sure which one is the right one to say. Um, so yeah, um, out of 10 I would say I give these shoes a good like 9. 
um, which is pretty damn high. Um, the only um, lower points for me is the price, but that's because I'm not kind of in a in that bracket. Um, generally speaking, I wouldn't necessarily spend eighty pounds on shoes, but um, some people would, and if you're in that price bracket, that's fine. Um, but I'm hoping that this will be an investment and these will last me a good long time. So, um, you know, if they do, then I'm very happy about that and I'm fine with the cost. Um, and in terms of comfort, after the initial breaking in, these have been super comfortable and I feel snazzy when I wear them, I'm not gonna lie. So, um, yeah, I am super happy with them. Um, I don't think there's much I would change actually, um, other than my foot size, but that's not the fault of Will's vegan store, that's the fault of my feet. <laughs> um, so yeah, I suppose that's the only thing to note, but it's, uh, I think you're either a fan of brogues on women or you're not a fan of brogues on women. Um, and there's always like, having big feet, I've always been a little bit like, I have man feet. And there is always a tiny bit of wearing brogues makes me feel like I have more man feet than I normally feel like I have man feet. but. Not that that should matter, anyway. That's probably not even relevant to put in here, but anyway. Um, it's just something that crosses my mind, so I'm putting it in. I'm waffling now, so I'm going to stop. <laughs> um, I hope you enjoyed this video. Let me know if you have bought anything from Will's Vegan Shoes, or if you're interested um, in buying anything, because uh, I think they are a really great um, company in terms of their ethics and um, their reduced impact on the world um so yeah it's great and i'm really pleased with these shoes um so yeah let me know what you think and if you like this video give it a like and a subscribe um or don't if you don't want to you can thumbs down that's all engagement <laughs> or mm, um yeah thanks for watching